Hey guys, welcome back to the Portsmouth Road to Glory. Today we have Chelsea, Tottenham and Manchester United. Three games in a row, potentially three losses in a row. Although Chelsea are in 10th place, it doesn't really make sense, does it? And I've just noticed as well, Dolberg is top scorer. Rodgers has fallen behind a little bit. We're going to have to change that. Although with Iheanacho coming in and getting a hat-trick in his first game... That was rather incredible. Is he going to catch up with Rodgers? I doubt it. But anyway, we will get into the game against Chelsea, who, as I said, are in 10th place. We are currently in 7th place. So technically, are we favourites for this one? Oh, that's weird. That is so weird. No doubt Chelsea have a strong lineup. We'll take a look in a moment. There is confirmation of Ian Acho's incredible start. Four goals already. Unbelievable, isn't it? But they do have Werner, Havertz. They've got... Uh, Kulusevski from Juventus. They've got Ziyech playing at central midfield. They've even got PK in defence. PK? What? I mean, <laughs> how has that happened? He must be about 37 now? 36? 37 years old? That's quite crazy, to be fair. And, of course, we've got Mason Mount against his old squad. And we've got a lot of ex-Chelsea players. So, yeah, let's see if... Oh, my God. Great pass. Let's see if we can do some damage against Chelsea today. But most likely, they're going to be doing damage to us here. Werner's running through. Try and get a tackle in. There's Tamori. Saka getting back as well. Nice. Let's put it out on the left side. Look at that. Cummings is in here. Do I go for a cross? Edge of the box, maybe? Nope. I made the wrong call. And now Pulisic is in. Oh, I think we've got lucky there. We did. We got very lucky. Ten minutes in and it's chaos already. Let's pass this inside to Mason Mount. Here's Ian Acho. Back to Mount. Over the top for Iheanacho. Again, probably the wrong call there to pass it to him. And there's PK cleaning up the mess. There is no way that Chelsea should be in 10th place. I don't know what's going on there. But then again, they are idiots for letting Mason Mount go. And Gilmore released into the free agents. What is that about? And we've just scored. <laughs> And it's Rodgers. He is now on 18 goals this season. He's one behind Dolberg. What a finish. Kind of out of nowhere. Just turned the defender. Finessed it. And it's gone in. I, I wasn't expecting it to go in. There it is. What a goal. Mendy with his abnormally long arms. Couldn't do anything about it. Oh, Mason Mount. What a pass. Saka's in. Up here to Nelson. Will it be 2-0? It will be. What? It's too easy. This is why Chelsea are in 10th. Defensively, they are all over the place. PK. Why do they have PK in defence? He must have about 30 pace at this point. Unbelievable. Nelson with a bit of a dodgy finish, though. It was pretty much down the middle of the goal there. Let's have a look. I tried to tuck it in the bottom right. And, uh, well, I mean, you can't really knock it. It's gone in. You can't say it's a bad finish, but should have tucked it away in the corner. Just that little bit more because... To be fair, the keeper could have saved that. Well, they could get one back here, though. Here's Kulusevski. Back for Adama. Good block. That's offside. It's offside. It's not going to count. But that, that shows why Chelsea are a dangerous team still. Going forward, what a team. They've got some incredible players in there. But clearly, as I said before, defensively, they're just not quite the same. I mean, they've got Koulibaly as well. Look, he's a good defender, but... How old is he now? 33? Something like that. They've got a very old, aging defence that really can't deal with an explosive team like ours. We might get through again here. Look at this. Oh, Iheanacho couldn't get there. You can see it, though. The gaps just appear. Come on, Saka. Get back. Oh, no. Oh, no. We're good. Holt, what a header that was. A little bit dangerous from Chelsea again, but we've got away with it. Now, here's Iheanacho. Over to Saka, who's absolutely out of energy now. He's got nothing left, but he's still going. Into Mason Mount. Could it be 3-0? I'm just going to have to play this one back and be a bit patient. Here's Nelson. Into Mason Mount. Finish it. Oh, my God. PK. I take it back. He's still class. <laughs> that was very good. Saka to take the corner now. It's not a great one, but we actually managed to get a header on it. Holt is unlucky not to score there. Could be 3-0. Unbelievable. What a first half. We have blown Chelsea away. Werner's barely had the ball. Havertz has barely done anything. We've managed to just keep them quiet. 
What a pass from Gilmore. Into Saka. Go on, just whip it in. Whoa! Oh my... <laughs> what is going on? What just happened? Oh my god. That cross was so dangerous. Chelsea couldn't deal with it. But here they come on the break now. Running back with Tamori. If anyone's going to catch Adama Traore, it might be him. And he's done so well there, Tamori. Well played. Let's get it up the pitch again. Nice little flick on to Gilmore. Into Iheanacho. Back inside to Mount. Over to Cummings. I love this formation. I love it so much. Come on, Cummings. Come on. Go on. Ah, oh, Mendy saves that one. Right, and also, you know the best thing about this formation? Now that I'm 2-0 up and I might want to go a little bit more of a solid kind of 4-2-3-1, I can do it without making changes if I really don't want to because I could play Tamori at right back. But realistically, what you do is you move Saka forward, you put Mount at Cam, you put Rogers up top, and then you can take Iheanacho off for a right back. Kenny comes in and then look at that. You've got a fully... Working 4 2 3 1. Holt can play left back. Saka's out on that right side. How amazing is that? And that's taking off Ian Acho. I could keep him on. I could take off Cummings and play Rogers on the left. I have such a versatile squad. I love it. But what I am going to do is bring in Hogg for Mount. I'm also going to bring in Curtis for Cummings. And obviously, Kenny is coming on at right back. Haven't used Kenny that much since we've moved to the three at the back. So it's still good to get him on, give him some minutes. He is a good player. <laughs> get up. No, ref, come on. Honestly, that's the first time Havertz has got forward and they looked so dangerous. I don't know why they're playing him as a central midfielder. Next to Ziyech as well. Like That is not a very balanced central midfield. That is why they're struggling. They've got such great players and they've got too many of them in the same position because clearly they can't get them all in the side. Ziyech and Havertz as central midfielders. That is just very strange. Gilmore has slipped in and taken the ball there. Here he goes. Still going. I'm going to give that to Curtis, who's just come on, come on, of course. Look at Saka on the right side. We're going to pick him out. Can it be 3-0? Onto that left foot. Can he finish it? Oh, it's saved, I think. Was it saved? No, it was just wide. But yeah, I, I, I think that's why, guys, I'm able to dominate this game against Chelsea. They don't have a midfield. It's as simple as that. Oh, my God. Gilmore again. He's probably man of the match, to be fair. Gilmore has been absolutely everywhere. There he is again. He's actually so good. What a signing he's been from Chelsea, of course. Oh, I've just given it away, though. How long's left? Just a few minutes. I would like the clean sheet. Just realised Tamori's captain now. Oh, Baka's got to get that. No. Oh, my God. Okay, why couldn't Backer get to that? I don't know. And how has ZH missed that? Even with his right foot, you expect that to go in. Hog, put Rogers through. Oh, close. Oh, he's got around him. Careful. Inside. Nelson. I think, I think that's probably going to be it. Yeah, that's going to be offside. <laughs> why did I pass that? That's going to be game over. Chelsea lose again. They are going to be... Really struggling to get top six now. There, rich, there actually isn't that much time left of the season. And they have been beaten. Right, so it's time for the FA Cup game against Tottenham. I am changing up the squad quite considerably. Do I take Saka out? I haven't really used him as a right winger in a 4-2-3-1, for example. I kind of want to give him a go there. Uh, if not, maybe Gale will come on because he is lacking just a little bit of fitness. We've got Ian Acho starting up top on his own with Lingard behind him. Cummings, Hughes, Loftus-Cheek. Noga's going to play as a centre-back with Davies. We've got Luke Thomas at left-back. It's still a really strong squad. I'm going to have Fossey on the bench. We're going to rest Gilmore. Um, I might bring on Holt as well as a backup defender. Yeah, I think that's fine. We've got Curtis... Hunter. We've got some good options here. Of course, the FA Cup is something we've won already. It's not my absolute priority, but I'd love to beat Tottenham. Of course I would. Harry Kane starts. You know Tottenham mean business when they're starting Harry Kane. They've got Longley and I think it was Ake in defence. Who else have they got in the team? Zaniolo, McTominay. Wow, that is an interesting signing. He's actually a bit of a baller, but look at Lingard already making a great challenge. We've got the ball. 
That's a great pass from Loftus-Cheek into Saka. Cutting inside, of course. Into Lingard. Captain today. Going to dink it into the box. Cummings is there. It's not the ideal cross, but I had to go for it, I think. I think Lingard is the key to this game. You know, I haven't used him in a little while. I decided to give him the nod over Hogg. And I think he is going to be the key to breaking through this Tottenham side. Here is Grimaldo. What a signing that is as well. Noga steps up though. Nicely done. But now, Harry Kane, 24 yards out. Are they going to waste it and pass it short? Nope, he's going to go for it. I've jumped the wall, but it's, it's not enough. Harry Kane is a fantastic free kick taker. I knew it was going to go in. I, I just knew. Let's have a look at the replay. He's just... Oh, he's knuckled it, isn't he? Really good strike. Dyson has no chance. And we are 1-0 down. That could be 2-0. Oh, Dyson, you monster. What a save. Harry Kane should have made it 2-0 there. Now here's Lingard. Over the top for Cummings. It's a good pass. Okay, we've got Ian Acho running into the box. Can we pick him out? It's not bad. Long lays there. We're going to need to win this header. Uh, is that mine? It is. It's a corner. Saka to take it. Aiming for Ian Acho. Go on. Nope. Sommer's there. Comes out to Davies. Into Lingard now. Go on. Just run through. Keep going. Play it back inside the box now. Oh, that, that pass is not what I was looking for. We're getting into the game now. I can't believe we're 1-0 down. We haven't been that bad, you know. Wouldn't say we deserve to be losing. Bit of skill there from Lingard. Going to give that to Loftus-Cheek. <sighs> Blocked again. Why is Zaniolo so quick? What the hell is that? Oh my god, Dyson is keeping us in this game. How quick was Zaniolo? Unbelievable. He showed serious pace there. Up against Davies, who isn't exactly slow. But you know if Tamori... Holt, Backer, any of those guys was chasing. I think we would have got the ball there. Anyway, play on. Here is Luke Thomas. Nice. He gets past McTominay with a little skip. What do we do from here, though? Saka's made a good run. Oh, Iheanacho's there. Ah, oh, the cross. It's just not going to work. A couple of minutes until the break here. Let's get another corner in. That's a better delivery. Iheanacho's is... Oh, he's, he's there, but he's just... Oh, he can't angle it. And we really don't need a replay for that to see if it crossed the line. It very clearly didn't. This is it for the first half. Last chance for Tottenham. They're going to get cross in. No, they're just going to run backwards and waste it. Okay, that's fine by me. 1-0 down. We need to do something in this second half. Do I change up the team? I, I don't know. The one player that isn't really doing much is Loftus-Cheek. But he's playing a bit deeper than I'd like. What if I take Lingard and move him... Over to the left here a little bit. Take Hughes. Don't worry, I'm going to swap them around. Put him there as well. And then it's basically a 4-1-4-1. And then put Loftus-Cheek just slightly further forward. And then change the instruction to stay forward and stay forward. And then obviously we'll get Hughes to sit back. Maybe that's what we should do. It's going to mean we're defensively a little bit weaker. But I think Hughes can do a good enough job there. It does mean, though, that Loftus-Cheek and Jesse Lingard are going to be running at the uh, the Tottenham defence. So let's see if it makes a difference. There is a massive hole in, in my midfield now. You see that? That is crazy. Saka into Iheanacho. Over here to Cummings. Can he keep it in? Just about. I don't want to cross it. It hasn't been working. Give that to Lingard. Into Iheanacho. Loftus-Cheek's in. Is he on? He is! Tactical masterclass, guys. It's all up in here. I'm a genius. Who needs Arteta? Throw me into the Arsenal job. I will do a fantastic job. I'd win us games. Well, we're, we're drawing right now, but we will win this game. Look at this piece of genius tactician work. I've got Loftus-Cheek further forward and he scored. It's, it's so simple, isn't it, this management game? Who needs to get badges their coaching badges nah just play career mode for 11 years on youtube and you are a fully qualified manager that can out tactic jose Mourinho. seriously though it has actually worked it has worked so well look at this we've got so much more going forward into cummings now holy crap back to your oh oh my i tried to sweat it i tried to sweat it 
But actually, no. I, I played a 1-2 off the defender. That was the plan all along. What a lucky goal. Cummings scores again. And it is going to be the 1-2 off Ake. <laughs> that is amazing. And we've turned it around. There it is. Okay, I am going to make a change now because we're winning. I don't think we need to be so attacking. But I am going to bring on Gale. And I'm going to bring in Fossey. I'm just going to bring him back a little bit. I know this is a bit of a janky formation. But I quite like Lingard being slightly to the left. It has been working. So I quite like that. And I'm also going to bring in Holt for the rest of this second half. We've got 20 minutes to go here. Let's just uh, make sure we get the win. That's the most important thing here. Oh, go on, Fossey. Good first touch. He hasn't scored for us yet. And he's not going to if I turn that way. Give it to Gale. Back to Fossey. Inside for Lingard. What a turn that is. Oh, Lingard's so close. Almost three goals against Tottenham. I'd love to get another one. Come on. Here's Cummings. Come on. Oh, my. Okay. <laughs> I don't know why I took that short. And now we've got to get back. Please don't score now. Yes, Kenny. No. What the hell is that? That's not right. If they score from this. Don't you even think about it. No. No penalty. Get rid of it. Just get rid of it. Get in there. Get out, Tottenham. The FA Cup just isn't for you. I'm sorry. It doesn't matter who you play. It's just not for you. It's not for you. Looking at the other results, West Ham have knocked out Arsenal. We've got Brighton beating West Brom on penalties. Man City have beaten Exeter City. Leicester are through against Liverpool. Wolves have gone through against Southampton. We've beaten Spurs. QPR have beaten Stevenage. And Everton have beaten Manchester United. That's fantastic. Going into the quarterfinals... A lot of the stronger teams have been knocked out. Liverpool and Manchester United both out. That is incredibly lucky. Thank you. Thank you very much. But now, guys, it's time for the dreaded trip to Old Trafford. One of the toughest places to go. It's going to be such a tough game, this. Marcus Rashford there. Who else have they got in the lineup? I see Greenwood. Bruno Fernandes. Lamar is playing at central midfield with Deli Ali. Who's on the left? Is that Martial? Should we have a look at their full team? Man, I love Old Trafford though. Look at that stadium. It is incredible. Martial's up top, so Rashford's on the left. They've got Skriniar and Sula, Wambasaka, Acuna, and De Gea in goal. Is that Acuna? Acuna? I don't know how to say his name properly. But uh, it's a good team. It is a very good team, and that is why they are up at the top of the table. You know, I think they're in second at the moment, but they have been f first a few times. But yeah, we'll, we'll see how we get on. I reckon we can do it. I really do. We're back to the three at the back formation. So Holt plays at centre-back again. He has been absolutely fantastic there. And he still gets forward, which you could argue is a little bit dangerous sometimes. Is Rogers Mount. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. That is absolutely disgusting. That is one of my favourite goals this season. The passing, the build-up, the little triangles, the one-twos. Oh, absolutely beautiful. That should be illegal. I love it. I love this formation. I love this team and I love Ian Acho. What a start to his Portsmouth career. At the end of this game, am I going to regret not signing Greenwood because he scored four against us or something? I don't think so. You know, I look at Greenwood in their team and think, yeah, he's a really dangerous player, but he doesn't really scare me like a Rashford does. Rashford running at you in FIFA? Nah, not fun. He's so, so good. But that is not a good cross from him there. Let's see if we can get forward again. Mate, if I can make it 2-0. Oh, my God. This formation is just so overpowered going forward because you quite literally overpower them. Well done, Cummings. Still going here. Let's put it over the top for Saka. Oh, is he going to get there? Yeah, I think just about. Oh, oh, that's unlucky. Honestly, though, yes, defensively it can be a bit weak at times, but try this formation. If you want to try it, this is what it looks like. It's a 3-4-1-2, effectively. Get your wingers to be somewhat decent at defending, like a Saka, so they can come back and help. But still, going forward, it's, it's just too much for the CPU to handle. All the runs being made, it's glorious. It's absolutely glorious. But you do need fast centre-backs like I have. It does help out massively. We're in again here. Oh, my God. Please be onside. He is. I'm going to try and 
Shoots it across the keeper. That I might regret. I might regret that. How close was it? Oh, it's so close. Look at that. Oh, my God. It should be 2-0. Here's the overload again. Saka into the box for Rodgers. Wamba Saka. That was cheeky. He just chests it down for the keeper. I quite like that. It's cocky and it's risky, but I, I rate the confidence. I really do. Here's Rashford again into Martial, who's barely even touched the ball. Tottenham have gone 1-0 up. Kane has scored. No surprise there. Greenwood to Wambasaka. I've made the tackle too early there. We're in trouble. Oh, that could have been a penalty. Probably should have been a penalty. I think we've got away with one there. Oh, oh my God. Cummings, he's just lost the ball again. He just sometimes feels really slow when I try and take on a player. I don't know what, what it is. That's right. Tamori's got that. And it's dealt with. Oh, please. Please don't come out for that, De Gea. He should have. Oh, my God. I've kept it in. No way. Here's Nelson. First time cross. Back post for Mount. And Wambis Saka has to head it over. Unbelievable. We're taking this short. I can run straight into the box. Chip it in. Go on, Nelson. Go on. Iheanacho. Oh, De Gea makes the save. This time I'm going to cross it. Mason Mount to whip it in. That's a good ball. Nelson's there. Skriniar defends it well. Now what? Oh, oh, how, how, how have I still got the ball? I don't know. I don't know how I've still got this. On the edge of the box here for Nelson. Go on, why not? Just hit it. Ah, De Gea makes another save and that is half time. Are you joking? Please, Stefan. No. What have I just done? Oh, I... <laughs> I'm going to watch it again. I, I, pfft, I thought I had time. Oh my, oh my God. That is something else. And the cheek of him to chip me like that. You naughty, naughty man. I cannot believe I've just given away a goal like that. That is embarrassing. Backer, your first touch, man. <laughs> that was so bad. I could have swore you had time. And then just out of nowhere, Rash uh, Rashford, Martial. Just, yeah, lots of speed. Got to the ball. It's okay. We'll score again. We will score again. Here's Rodgers. Mason Mount. Back to Rodgers. Oh, oh, Lamar. Since when did you turn into a prime central midfielder? I can't believe this. I can't believe this. What's happened? What's happened here? I've just gone from dominating this game, playing some really good football. Straight away after the first half, they scored two early goals and it's 2-1. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. Wow, we need two more goals to win this now. I've actually thrown this away. I can't believe it. Okay. Let's see if we can do something here. Here's Cummings. Hello. This could be good. This could be good. Oh. Foul? Hello? What? You are joking me. I couldn't, I couldn't pull it back. I couldn't do anything. I feel like he was pulling my shirt. Okay, right. Gale coming on. Uh, what else can I do? How is Hogg still 78 rated, by the way? How has he not gone up by one? I've still used him quite a bit this season. I'm going to put him on again. Although Mason Mount is doing so well. No, I'm not doing that. We'll bring on Curtis on the left. I don't think... Uh, Cummings has had much to do in this game. He hasn't really done much. Uh, do I go Hunter as well? Just kind of switch it up. Give Iheanacho a break. I, I, oh. No, I'm going to stick with it as it is. I don't, I don't need to make substitutions just because. I want to make them because they're going to impact the game. But yeah, that tactical masterclass against Tottenham. I don't know if I'm going to be able to repeat that against United. I'm struggling here. Oh, we've got it. Hello, come on. Go on, go on. No, I just passed it to Gale. I just passed it to Gale on the right side, but it didn't, it didn't go through. Damn. That's kind of annoying. Oh, my God. What a ball. Go on, Gale. Across the box. Oh, Rogers was in there. That was 2 all. If that cross goes in, it's 2 all. Genuinely. Mason Mount with the corner. Holt puts it wide. Frustrating, guys, because I am creating chances. I am actually playing pretty well in this game, but at the moment, we are going to be losing. We are running out of time here, guys. Less than five minutes. I don't think it's going to happen. Maybe we can rescue a point, but we're definitely not going to win it now. 
Here is Deli Ali. Plays it over to the left side. This is it. This is going to be 3-1 now. Oh, what a tackle. What a tackle. Play it forward now. Oh, my God. What a ball. Please, Ianacho. Please. Please. Oh, that's it. Maybe I get an equaliser if I win the ball there. But no, they're going to play this one out. Fair play to United. I made a mistake. They capitalised and then they finished me off within a, a second later. But actually, hang on. Hang on. It's not over yet. Mason Mount's in. I'm done. I'm an idiot. What was that finish? What was... Why... Why... Why did I do that? Why didn't I just leather it across the keeper? That was... That was too all right there. Oh, my God. Okay, well... Yeah, that sucked. That's the end of this episode, by the way. We will be coming back tomorrow with more. Hopefully, we can bounce back because losing to Manchester United has definitely set us back a little bit for that top six push. But you know what? We might still be there in a few games time. Thanks for watching and I will see you next time.